Hello, my loves. Welcome back to my channel. Can I just say that I feel like this year has flown by in a minute? I feel like we just celebrated New Year's yesterday and in a little over a month, it's 2016. That's bananas. But that also means that the holiday season is already in session. So I wanted to make sure that you girls were covered with easy but beautiful hairstyles that you can rock with pretty much anything. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how I created this beautiful, voluminous updo hairstyle. And the best part is it's completely heatless and took me under 10 minutes to create. <laughs> you think I'm kidding? I actually timed it, guys. Five minutes and 50 seconds, but who's counting? So I could have called this a five minute hairstyle, but I didn't want to show off. Another bonus, this hairstyle can be created on any hair length that is shoulder length or longer. And it also works better on second or third day old hair. So if your hair is a little dirty and greasy or a lot dirty and greasy, this hairstyle will be your new BFF. So without further ado, if you would like to see how I created this beautiful voluminous updo hairstyle, please keep watching. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is clip in a few wefts from my fancy hair extension set just to give this bun a little bit more volume. I separated my hair at ear level and tied away the hair at the top, and then I'm taking one of my two clip wefts and I'm clipping it into my hair at the roots and I'm clipping it in upside down. And I'm separating a section just above this one and clipping in another two clip weft exactly the same way as I did the other one. Now this is just going to ensure that these wefts lay flat against my head when I pull them up into a high ponytail to create my bun. For the next weft, I'm separating my hair from ear to ear at the top of my head and I'm clipping in this weft in the other direction. Since this weft is going to be pulled back with the rest of my hair into the ponytail to create the bun, this is why I clipped it in this way. I want to make sure that this weft also lays flat against my head. So I have one more two clip weft in my set and I'm just going to separate a section just above the last weft that I clipped in and clip in this weft exactly the same way. So now that I've clipped in four of my fancy hair extension wefts into my hair, I'm pulling back all of my hair into a high ponytail and I'm making sure to smooth out the hair all around my face. Once I have the shape that I like, I'm taking a good strong hair elastic and tying my hair into a high ponytail. Next, I'm taking sections of hair from the ponytail and I'm lightly teasing them with my hairbrush. I'm not using a teasing brush for this because I don't want them too teased. I just want to create enough texture that I can play with them and mold them to the shape of my liking. When you finally look like Cousin It from the Adams Family, you know you're good to go. Okay, so now that I've lightly teased all of these sections around my hair, all I'm doing is fanning my hair over the base of the ponytail, and then I'm going section by section and turning the ends of the section inwards and curling them inwards until I reach the base of the ponytail. Then I'm taking a few bobby pins and pinning down the curled up section to the top of my head. And all I'm gonna do from here is just repeat the exact same steps with the remaining sections until I have a big voluminous bun. And that's all there is to this. I didn't use any sock buns, mesh buns, or anything for that matter. I just used my own hair and a few wefts from my fancy hair extension set. If your hair is super thick and it is longer than shoulder length, you can definitely get away with creating this voluminous bun without adding any hair extensions. But if your hair is thin or fine, adding in just a few wefts from a clip-in hair extension set will give you that volume that you want. I personally love this look. I feel like it's perfect for the holiday season. It's so festive and I really hope you guys try it out. All right, my darlings, that wraps up today's tutorial. I really hope you guys try out this hairstyle over the holiday season and let me know what you thought about this video in the comments below. Oh, and I also want to hear from you guys, what are you looking forward to most this time of year? I personally always look forward to getting together with my family and my husband's family and food is a major, major thing in my culture. So I really can't wait to dig into my mom-in-law's yummy, yummy dishes and just hang and laugh and just enjoy each other's company. Seriously guys, if there's one thing that I cherish most in this entire world, it's family. I may sound like a sap, but it's so, so true. And the older I get, the more I realize it and the more that I appreciate it. I always say family isn't just everything, it's the only thing. I wish all of you guys an amazing holiday season with your loved ones and before before you go, please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one. Thank you so much for watching you guys, I love you and I hope to see you in my next video.